What is up, everybody? Frankie 5152. Hope you all had a great weekend. I had a fantastic weekend. Sorry I did not get any videos done yesterday or over the weekend. I was pretty busy. I did make it to Legend 2, but I have been winning 2, losing 1, winning 2, losing 1 in Legend ranks so far. So um, I will get a PvP video probably to you tomorrow. Um, but we got a couple things to go over first. Uh, Galactic Origin has dropped. I'm yet to look even at the box yet. And Jesse is here. So today's episode, we will spend what little gems I have. I have 1,500 gems, so that will be enough for 30 packs. So let's get those open. I'll read the cards. And then, if it's not too late, we will do a, a Jesse Farm. Seeing how he's here, I'll show you the deck that I am currently using. I got to thank the guys from the Jurassic Impact Discord for coming up with the farming deck used so far um it uses jaden yuki and the skill reinforcements um and blue eyes deck so i think you've seen it before but we will go over it just in case um so here we go first 10 packs let's see if we get something good different cards there's no limit to the number of cards in players hands all right Gladiator Beast Octavius. When this card is special summoned by the effect of Gladiator Beast Monster, target one face down spell or trap card in the spell and trap card zone. Destroy that target at the end of your battle phase. If this card attacked or was attacked, shuffle this card into the deck and or discard one card. Huh. Interesting. Neo Spacian Aqua Dolphin. Once per turn, you can discard one card. Look at your opponent's hand. Choose one monster card in it. If you control a monster with attack greater than or equal to the attack of the chosen card, destroy the chosen card and inflict 500 damage to your opponent. Otherwise, take 500 damage. That's dangerous. That's dangerous. Pyramid of Light. If this face-up card is removed from your side of the field, destroy Androfinx and Sphinx Telia on your side of the field and remove them from play. Gladiator Beast... Mermillo. When this card is special summoned by the effect of Gladiator Beast, target one face-up monster. Destroy that target. At the end of the battle phase, if this card attacked or was attacked, you can shuffle into the deck. Special summon one Gladiator Beast monster from your deck, except this one. All right. Fiend's Hand Mirror. Switch the opponent's spell card effect that targets one spell or trap card to another correct target. All right. Neo Spacian Twinkle Moss. What kind of name is that? Uh, this card name is also Glow Moss. This card cannot be special summoned except with Nex. When this card attack is attacked, draw one card, reveal that card, and based on its type, apply the proper effect. Monster and the battle phase. Spell, you can change this card to direct deck trap. The monster is changed to defense position. Okay. Gladiator Beast is Dorari. Two Gladiator Beast monsters must be first must first be special summoned from your extra deck by shuffling the love card in your control deck. You do not use polymerization. Alright. Uh, disarm. Return one Gladiator Beast card from your hand to the deck and negate the vacuum spell and destroy it. Alright. Bottomless Shifting Sand at the end of your opponent's turn. Destroy the face-up monster with the highest attack on the field during your own standby. If you have four or less cards in your hand, this card is destroyed. All right. Fire Formation Tekken. Activate during your main phase. When this card is activated, target one beast warrior type monster you control. During this phase, if the effects are negated, also it is unaffected by the effects of cards and other cards on the field. Uh, all beast worship my... Alright. 300. 300 attacks, nice. Neo Spacian Air Hummingbird. Once per turn, you gain 500 life for each card in your opponent's hand. Gladiator Beast. At the end of the battle phase, this card was attacked, summoned. Alright, Gladiator. Sphinx tell you. Wow. I don't think this thing has enough stars. You can pay 500 left points to special summon this card when Pyramid of Light is on the field. Alright. 
This card cannot attack during the turn that it is normal or special summon. This card cannot be special summoned from the graveyard. If this card destroys a defense position monster as a result of battle and flight damage, to your opponent's left point is equal to half the defense of the monster destroyed. Okay. That's an interesting card. Um, wow, look at this thing. When this card is normal summon, you gain control of one, of one face down defense position monster your opponent controls until the end phase of this turn. Oh my god, is this card awesome. Huh. Gotta find a way to use that, eh? When a Jax monster is added from your deck to your hand, you can reveal that monster to special summon. That's a needed card for the Gen X cards. Did we get something good? Life Absorbing Machine. During your standby phase, life gain life points equal to the half of the total life points you paid during your last turn. That's good for Psychic decks. You do not pay life points to activate spell cards. Oh. Brotherhood of Fire Fist Swallow. You can special summon this card from your hand by sending three face-up fire formation spell trap cards you control to the graveyard. When this card is normal or special summon, you can set one fire formation trap card directly from your deck. You can only use the effect of Brotherhood of Fire Fist Swallow once per turn. Face-up beast warrior type monsters you control cannot be targeted by your opponent's card effects. Well, that's pretty nice. Gladiator Beast Sukdor. Worm. Ooh, a new worm. Flip. You can equip this card to a monster your opponent controls as an equip card. Inflect 400 damage to the controller of the equipped monster during each standby phase. Oh, that's pretty fun. So that will tie up some back row, as well as tie up the monster. Uh, that is going to find some usage in some burn decks, that's for sure. This card cannot be normal summoned or set. This can cannot be special summoned except for playing 500 when both Andro Sphinx and Sphinx Tilia are on your side of the field are destroyed at the same time. Then you can special summon this monster from your hand or deck when this card is special summoned successfully to increase the attack of this card by three. <laughs> oh my goodness. Well, isn't he special? He's going to probably be a lot useful in um, farm decks. Uh, return one Gladiator Beast card from your hand to the deck and negate the activation effect of a trap card. Destroy it right. Got another one of those worms. You got an Android Sphinx there. There he is. Yeah, this card cannot be summoned from... If this card destroys a defense prison, it will inflict damage to your monster's life points equal to that. Excited to see some things decks then. Uh, Trojan Gladiator Beast. Special summon one Gladiator Beast monster from your hand to your opponent's side of the field, then draw one card. Alright. Gladiator Beast Augustus. When this card is special summoned by the effect of Gladiator Beast, you control special blah 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 blah. blah. Alright. And then we have Entomon here, Aqua Neos. So it must be first special summon from your extra deck by shuffling the cards. Destroy one random card in your, in your opponent's hand. You can discard one. Alright, that's not bad. Add another card to the elementals. Not too bad for a first 10. No URs though. That's what we really need. We need those URs. Infinite cards. No new cards there. Neo Bug. A huge bug like monster is said to come from another planet and gathers in swarms. That's a pretty good insect bug beast. Neo Space. Element of Hero Neos and all of fusion monsters that list. Element of Neos is a fusion monster. Gain 500 attack. Monsters do not have to activate their effects during the end phase that shuffle them into the extra deck. That's nice. There we go. We got that third worm. Terra Firm Gravity. During each opponent's battle phase, if you control them in Terra Firma, this turn, all level 4 or lower monsters your opponent controls that can attack a face-up element of Terra Firma 
you control must attack it and cannot otherwise attack. All right. Then we got a shiny Neo space. Cool. Um, and first aid squad. Target one normal monster in your graveyard. Add it to your hand. When a normal monster is destroyed by battle, you can special summon this card from your graveyard and defense position as a normal monster warrior type earth. 1200 attack for it. This card not, is not treated as a trap card. You can only use the effect of first aid on once per turn. If summoned this way, banish this card when it leaves the field. It's an interesting card. I don't fully understand it though, to be honest, so I'll have to see that in play a couple. Uh, instant Neo Space, equipped only to a fusion monster that lists Element Hand Nero as a fusion monster. It does not have to activate its effect during the end phase and shuffles off in the extra deck. Alright. Another Sphinx. There we go, another SR. Another First Aid Squad. Fortunately, not a new one. Elementor Hero Marine Neos. All right. Destroy one run card in your opponent's hand. Nice. That's a pretty strong one. Ally of Justice Searcher. Mm -hmm. Once per turn, discard one card to select one face down defense position mounting your opponent controls and changes the face up attack and flip effects are not affected at this time. This card is awesome. But you're going to need something in your hand to re to re bring those cards back from your graveyard, unfortunately. Uh, discard all face-up reptile worm monsters you control to face down defense position except this card. All right. Some worm support. Remove brainwashing. The control of all monsters in the field returns to their owners. All right. When this card is destroyed by battle and sent to the graveyard, you can special summon one machine type monster with 1500 less to attack from your deck in the face up attack position. Alright. Not sure who I would use that on quite yet. Gladiator Beast Battle Hybrid. Equip only Gladiator Beast monster when it attacks. Destroy one spell or trap card at the end of the damage step. When the equipped monster is returned from your side of the field, to the deck and this card is sent to the grave. Return this card to your hand. That's next. Let's see, and this is next. Send one face up Neo Spacian monster you control to the grave. Special summon one level four monster with the same name from your extra deck. All right, so that works on your fusion Neo Spacians. <sighs> what is this? Refusion? Activate this card by paying 800 left points, then target one fusion monster in your graveyard. Special summon and equip it with this card when this card is destroyed. Banish the equip monster. Okay. Two of the same SRs. We have 500 more gems that we are going to spend. And then we will do the farm. So let's hope for a UR. So 20 packs in, no URs yet. Ally just an unknown crusher. When this card battles a light monster, remove the monster from play after damage calculation. Field barrier. Field cards on the field cannot be destroyed. Neither player can activate a new field spell card. You control only one field barrier. Huh. Can dog beast warrior a ninja dog who has mastered the extreme ninja through hard training and learned the technique to metamorphose into a human being. That's pretty good. Test eight. When this card is destroyed by battle and sent to the graveyard, you can special summon one level four lower glider every mask from your deep from your deck. All right. Just another way to get those out. Caravan of the ice barriers. Ooh, a new ice barrier card. Once per turn, you can select two Ice Barrier cards in your graveyard, return the selected monster to the deck, and each player draws a card. That's nice. This Disciple of the Forbidden Spell Warrior. When this card is summoned, declare a different monster card attribute equal to the number of Disciples of Forbidden Spell in your graveyard. If this card attacks a monster that has the declared attribute, destroy the monster with the cards 
effect without applying damage. All right. There's another Brotherhood of the Fire Fist. If you control a fire formation spell trap card or no monsters, you can special summon this card from your hand. Well, that's nice. Weak defense, though. Hopefully a new or a new assistant glow mod. When this card attacks or is attacked, your opponent draws one card. Reveal the monster and battle phase. Alright. So it's a great way to get them to draw cards too, so. In the flight, if this card is used to ritual summon severe queen of dragons, you must also tribute monsters from your hand field. Alright. If a ritual monster you control would be destroyed by battle or card effects while this card is in your graveyard, you can banish this. Oh my goodness. Ooh, Gladiator Beast Lakori. So another, this is the big Gladiator Beast here. So that's one we're going to need three of if we're going to build a Gladiator Beast deck. Alien of Justice Reverse Break. Uh, if a face-up light monster is on the field, destroy this card. If this card attacks a face-down defense monster, destroy that monster immediately with the card effect without flipping its face up or applying damage calculation. Alright. Two fire fresh formers. Alright. That's just, just too much reading. You guys are going to have to read them. Um, effects of white monsters that battle this card are negated. Hero Gloss Neil. So another one. Lots of reading. Glitter Beast. It is equipped only Glitter Beast. It gains 300 attack when the equipped monster is returned from your side of the field to the deck. So another card that goes to your hand rather than going to the graveyard. Ooh, did we finally get our first UR? Infinite cards. The hand size limit of becomes three. Ouch. Ally Justice Unlimiter. You contribute this card, select one face up Ally Justice monster you control and double its original attack until the end phase of its turn. That's not bad. Cosmic Cyclone. Pay 1,000 life points, then target one spell trap card in the field and banish it. Yeah, that. I got hit by that card earlier. So that's that. Uh, we only got one of the URs, so we got a lot to go, unfortunately. Um, and then let's go to the let's go, Jesse Farm. My heroes are ready to Show you the deck down. real quick. <laughs> Here it is. Quick little reinforcements. Um... It is not 100%. And, um, that's the problem with it so far. It's not 100% guaranteed. Um, it is more like 80, 80%, my guess is. Um, and it doesn't get, right now it's getting 7 to 8K due to the fact of the, um, bonus 1,000 points. Um, but it's more of a six to seven K, maybe even a five. So here we go. Jesse, you're a nice. Hey, Jay. Duel. My turn. Let's do it. I draw. I'm setting a monster. I set a card. My turn. Here I done. go. I draw. Say how to... Battle. Sink your fa... Check out my face down card. My trap activates. Uh, actually, that's going to work out. Oh, it's okay. Absolutely. Let's grab another blue. My monster's effect activates. Amber Mammoth. Special. I oh, end yeah. my turn. 
bids. I draw. All right. I set a card. Oh, I forgot to activate the reinforcements. So we're gonna lose because I wasn't paying attention. So there we go. Um, you want to have that happen. Yeah, that was pretty bad. Uh, not the good farm I wanted to show you guys. But I screwed up by not activating the effect because I wasn't really paying attention. There may not have been enough to... I think it needs to be 1800 for a reinforcement. So it may not have been. So it just might have been one of those times. Um, it has worked. But it does need a little bit of tweaking. Um, because as you just saw, it's not 100%. And if I'm having a farm deck, I'd rather have it 100%. Details. It does need to be 1800, and that was only 1700, so. Maybe I'll come up with a better deck. But yeah, spend some time. I haven't spent much. Um, we'll do this real quick. We'll play, we'll play one match. Let's get our game on. Cause that was pretty poor. Show you the deck I'm using right now in the KC Cup grindage. Right here, this little uh, Weevil Burn. Uh, it's been pretty successful. Like I said, it's got me to Legend Two right now. So let's hop into that. Like I said, it's like win two, lose one. Win, lose, win two, lose. Well, that was a whole bunch of wins. I would like to see a study of, of winning percentages with decks done by certain players. Like if they're playing at night, playing in the morning, when they have 10, they have more success. Or even weekdays versus weekends. Um, I know I was doing really well. Um, I want to say Saturday around 10 a.m. Uh, Friday after 10 a.m. I was doing really well. So Here comes my best just curious shot. on that kind of stuff. Activate this thing. I have. I activate a continuous spell. Set this. Spell. I set a card face down. Set this. I set a card face down. We'll get him out. Exactly or her. Because if we can do damage, we're going to do damage. Uh, I attack. Uh, I end my turn. It's my turn. I draw. I won't help. I activate a continuous spell. I'm not spell. giving up. And now we're looking pretty good. There it is. A quick, quick surrender. We'll play another match. We will play some more. One more match. This person here has hit King of Games a couple times. Got a Rex deck. All right. I set a card 
face down, I set a car. Get ready. I summon a monster. I end my turn. Ah, uh, Sergeant Electra. We're just gonna have to take this damage here. Here I come. My turn. My turn. I draw a card. That won't help. I have to make a continuous spell. This is far from over. Let's have ourselves a bat. You're in for a licking. Attack! I end my turn. <laughs> Draw. I activate a continuous spell. I set a monster. I it's end my, turn. my turn. I draw a card. <laughs> Activate a continuous spell. Let's have ourselves a battle. My monster's gonna stop ya. My monster attacks. My monster's effect activates. I end my yeah. turn. Hmm. What Next to do? Draw. Really use a jade insect You're whistle right about now. I All right. a monster in a battle. I'll trounce ya. I attack with my monster. That won't help. My monster's a monster activates. activates. Get ready. Oh. I special summon a monster. How much I can do about this? I'll I failed. Ya. I forgot about that. My monster attacks your life points directly. Back to the stone. Going according to my <laughs> 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 really screws up this deck. It really does. Um, seen a lot of people playing it too, so that's gonna be it for now. Um, Tomorrow will be a full PvP kind of video, so keep an eye out for that. Uh, thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe, hit that like button, leave a comment if you wish. And I'll get back to you, alright? Till next time, guys. Have a great one.